The U.S. Army has today arrested one of its own on suspicion of espionage. Warrant Officer First Class James Hall was arrested after a search of his home in Georgia. More from ABC's Dennis Trout. Hall is being held at Fort Stewart, Georgia, where he's been serving in the intelligence section of the 24th Infantry Division. Army officials say they've had him under surveillance since last summer. Sources say Hall was spying for East Germany, both from the U.S. and from West Germany, where he was stationed for eight of the last 12 years. Hall's specialties are electronic warfare and signal intelligence, and he holds a top-secret security clearance. Government officials believe he was selling American codes and ciphers, the keys to decoding messages, for up to several hundred thousand dollars. Analysts say that not only was U.S. information compromised, but reworking those U.S. codes will be expensive. If, in fact, he's been giving codes and ciphers in the 19, late 1980s, this is going to cost us dearly into the 1990s. Paul's big spending habits helped tip officials off to possible wrongdoing, but neighbors found nothing suspicious about Hall and his We've family. They appear to be a very nice family. They've got two children who've played with our children. You know, I've noticed nothing unusual about the family. This is the latest in a series of military spy cases in recent years. The John Walker espionage ring, uncovered in 1985, had delivered Navy codes and information on ship movements to the Soviets. Retired Sergeant Clyde Lee Conrad was accused this summer of selling secret information on NATO troop deployments to the East Bloc. While authorities don't think this newly discovered conspiracy is as big or damaging as the Walker espionage organization was, they have arrested a Turkish man believed to be Hall's handler and courier. He's in custody in Tampa, Florida, and officials still are investigating to see whether any others might have been involved. Dennis Trout, ABC News, Washington.